Previously, the nominations were revealed. The housemates nominated for eviction are Pamela and Darren. <gasps> Thanks, guys. And Tara and Darren drew battle lines. Tara causes uneasiness in the house. You're not sure whether it's up or it's down. His jokes are with a twist of mean evilness. Tonight, Jedward grew up punk. Rock star! Yeah. Kerry's had enough. Get that shit cleaned up now, you pair of jackasses! And Pamela's evicted. I love you guys. But there's a twist. Half of the remaining housemates are about to be put up for eviction. Dear 14, 7.43 a.m. It's a lazy start in the Big Brother house. Don't. Ah, it does get up. Are you guys just get up? Today, either Pamela or Darren will be evicted. See you at the finish line, see you at the finish line. If you got the heart to join us. Get up, John. Get up. Seriously. Get the hell up, Bobby. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Ah, get off me. Loser. <laughs> Swear to God. Well, it's going to be an interesting day, I think. Everything's in this house is interesting. I know you haven't really seen eye to eye with me, but you know. No, it's not always that. I, I, sometimes I get, you know, I get scared of you. Sometimes you, you give me like, like I don't know, scared. And like you give me dirty looks, and I don't want to see it. I hate you, Darren. I don't, there's nothing like that. You know, you're a grown man, and you're giving me these looks. I'm not gonna talk to you when you're you. I don't. I tell you, you're gonna bite my head off. You know, that, that the way you were looking at me, so if you come out of this house, you're gonna say, that Tyree, you know, or say, oh, I'm gonna get her, you watch, you know, like, like and, and that's what it looks like. Well, the, you're saying that, that that's vindictive. I'm not, I'm not a vindictive person. But that's how it looked like. Well, dramatic, but I didn't think it was that intense. But... That's how I felt. Yeah. I mean, we're all, we all feel things differently, but. Fickle. You know, you know, it's, it's good now. You know? Like this is great, you know. Then we're, then we're good. But when I'm getting looks from you, like, you know, I was getting, yeah. And I was getting those looks. I was like, I was, well, I was just trying. Because you were mad, and maybe that's. I was just trying. I was just trying to make eye contact so that we could actually. Who's gonna you know, make yesterday? But now this is like nice eye contact. But when you're giving someone the dirtiest look, who's gonna stay around that? You just get the hell out. I um, I respect what you're saying. Oh, I'm glad we had this conversation. I, the last thing I would want to do is make uh, make someone someone scared. Mm. So I apologise for that if I did. It's it's okay, and I forgive you. Nine thirty a.m. Jedward are using Amy's eyeliner to draw on tattoos. Today is Kerry's daughter's birthday. Ten. It's a big age. Ten years old. Ten is big. Like you said, double digit, it's huge. So fast how time goes by, huh? Oh, I can't believe she's ten. She's ten? I've got a ten-year-old daughter, me, Tara. Feels like grown up. <laughs> oh. Paddy and Darren are bonding. You think I've been a good housemate, Paddy? What? You think I've been a good housemate? It's my life. You're going to feel better. All my life. Thanks. I'm not just saying that. I'm not kissing no one's ass. Never kissing man's ass in my life. You're a natural crack. You're good, honestly. I think you've been a great.
Huh? We've only had a bit of music in here, we're glad, haven't we? Huh? We've only had a bit of music. I really just want to take that song right now. Big Brother, can we ever take that song right now, please? God forbid if you go, I'd be... I'd be, I'd be like lonesome here. Yeah. Be the same for me. Million love songs made up. We've had some great conversations. Yeah. We've had some amazing laughs together. Oh, we have, yeah. Definitely, 100% now. Twelve thirty-two p.m. Jedward have completed their body art. She done it all, and they get now giving it back to me. It's not. It gone. So it obviously has. It is gone. Totally gone. It was gone even before we started. If you would have asked me, then fair enough. But you ain't asked me. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And this is like really like. I'm not, I'm not moaning at you, boys. I really am not moaning at you. But to be honest with you, this eyeliner. You've not, you've not even asked me. If, if, if I borrowed something from you, I'd ask you straight away, and you've not even asked me. Some of the house mates are talking about doing time. I couldn't imagine being in prison 20 years. This is nothing. No, but it's a bit, it's luxury. It's kind of luxury kind of prison. <laughs> True. I mean, you can't get out. It's like house arrest. Yeah. Except worse. House arrest, can you have friends over? Yeah, you just can't go out of your house. You get the tag, don't you? Yeah, I had that. Sure. I did. I put a bracelet, two bracelets, each leg. Why were we under house arrest? I, I had my first DUI. Oh. What's that? Which, driving under the Which is wrong. You know, there's a price to pay, but I paid overabundance. Oh, everyone does it in LA. Is it in... Bad. I mean, they handed the book down to me. I don't understand why drink driving is rice rife in LA. I mean, they're treated... Well, you're treated so like cheap. a criminal. That you are a criminal like, if you horrible. do that. Horrible. I mean... People if It's dangerous. What, 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 no, it is. No, there is. Really how, how, how many no times the limit? How many I mean, times the limit it. were you? Just a little bit. And then you did. Then there was a second time as well, was it? Mm. The first time. You did it again. Huh? You did it again I had after that. Also, on Why top of that. Why did you do that, it again after six months of house arrest? I had. You don't even have time <coughs> to think. Yeah, you do. I've got no doubt. Yeah, you I do. I had three hundred and fifty on top of all that, the bracelets and everything. Yeah. Then I had a limit. I had to do three hundred and fifty hours of community service. Yeah, really good. good. Yeah. Okay. And did that And you can't drive. Then you did it again. <laughs> and then you but then you drive. did it again. Oh God. Twelve forty-six p.m. Some of the housemates are discussing sexy movies. Do you remember Nine and a Half Weeks? I haven't seen Nine and a Half Weeks. You've never seen Nine and a Half Weeks. <sighs> really naughty Sick. film, but a brilliant I love film. naughty films. Eyes Wide Shut, have you seen that? Yeah, it was shit. I, I like the whole masquerade. You need to get yourself a, a bit of a tugging toilet, you do. Right? <laughs> you do, mate. Before you start humping our legs. Jedward are feeling rebellious. You're crazy. Here's it. Ready? Mm. Hey guys, it's punk rockers John and Edward here. It's in the punk Paris. rocker day. You know, we're not wearing tops, we're just wearing leather, we're wearing black, black runners. Seeing we're dressed as punk rockers day. Today's a rebellious day for me and John. We're not taking beep from no one. We're not taking BS from anybody, okay? We're gonna do what we want. Well, clean it up. You clean it up. Don't you talk to me like that, y'all. Get out of bed. I ain't getting out of bed. Don't talk to me like that. Yeah, we're gonna be really rebellious today. We're gonna be like flipping mattresses. We're always rebellious. Everything. We're always rebellious, but we're always cool. Whatever. <laughs> Everything all right, Jedward? Yeah. Yes. Everyone's okay, big brother. We're fine. I just have no energy at all. My uh, uh, arms. Uh, take your hands off me. Okay, go. Okay. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. <laughs> 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 
in the garden. Oh, I hate your chair. I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, he did not. What did he do? He threw a chair in the pool. Rock stars. <laughs> do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Tony. High five, high five. Not the table, man. Not the table. Nice. Look at their faces. They're all in shock. We're the punk rockers. We can't help our bad behavior. Yeah, we'll rock you out of it. Hey, girls. We'll let them get away with murder. We've got to make it look like they're wet in the bed. It's a ganglet! It's a ganglet! Oh crap. Come on, Pete. Get a little drink of water please. and just pour it near his crunch. Yeah. I want you to shave and film the faces right up. Oh, mate, I'll do that. Boys. Boys, stop here. Get talk to us, are punk rockers. Yeah. Coming up, Bobby gets punked. Bro! And Kerry's birthday wish comes true. Hi, Mummy. Hello, baby girl. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. One or three p.m. Lucian is severing the damage. What's happened? What? What's happened? Yeah. John and Edward, that's what's happened. Just not like punk rockers, they think they can trash the place. Well, Off tables know. and chairs. You said the... they go at What? Off tables and chairs in the pool. <coughs> They're really pissing me off today. Are they? Jedward is scheming in the storeroom. You only ask forgiveness. Stop! This girl's pretty strong. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, back up, girl! Back up, girl! This is the guy's room! <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. I told you not to come into the girls' room, the guys' room. Back out, punk. This is the guys' room. Don't come back, loser. It's got punks. What? What? <laughs> Soup. Go, punk. Just get out of here. Can I go on the attack? No. Because carpets don't you run around here. than you two. Pair of no 
Dumpties. Fell over. I saw you, babe. I was fucking idiot. No, I don't find that funny. That's not, it's not funny joking. at all. Fucking far from a joke, there. Clean up this mess now. She nearly broke her ankle. You better clean this mess, fool. Let's clean it. I don't want no one breaking no ankles. How do you mean to hurt anyone? I know. I know. She hurt herself. What? She hurt herself. You know what? I shouldn't have to do this for Carrie. This no, no, no. Let them do it. Don't you do it, Mumbles. Mm. No, because they will do it. Carrie just screamed at them. Let them do it. Yeah. They are taking it out. So you piss now. No, They're so immature. I've never met kids so immature. Not. Immature like you can't believe. My four-year-old acts. My little godson acts a lot more older than them two. Do you know what I mean? It's just a whole. You know, let's get dressed up and we are these people. Do you know what I mean? It's banter. It's banter. Do you know what I mean? It's funny, but then... oh, it's banter. But now they're pissing me off. Yeah, I've been in the house with them now for two weeks, and they're now right pissing me off. Yeah. 1:28 p.m. Jedward are trying to make amends. Okay, okay, we didn't mean to bring it into the whole thing. It's like... I know, well, the adults should know bleeding better to play along with you. Well, you shouldn't go over there if you see it's a war zone. No, I didn't see you all know I was in there. It's not the point. You should be doing what you're doing. It's, a it's right. getting ridiculous it's now. Right. Chill out. It's just a bit of afternoon fun. Okay. You need to go have a playroom and grow up. My son's three and he acts older than most of the people in here. Oh. Sorry, Bobby. Shut up. <laughs> I am sorry. You don't, you don't have to apologise. I'm so still in my head right now. It was funny. Oh. The furniture is in the swimming pool. <laughs> Amy is feeling the strain. I'm having a really bad day today. <clears throat> what is it, Amy? I'm just, I'm just finding it really hard. <laughs> With like, it's like Kerry's like having a hard day. Chad would have just <laughs> pissed me off big time. Like they've just got to me like, when they're on you and they're just like, it pisses you right off. It's pissed me right off, basically. And today they're trashing the bedroom. I like banter, but it's just taking it to another level. It's like they're four year olds in the house. It feels like I've got to look after them. And they're like two years younger than me. Do you know what I mean? They're just like bugging me, like they've took my eyeliner as well. Fair enough, I've got loads of eyeliners, but they've took my liquid eyeliner and they've not even asked me, big brother. They've got no respect. Like, if that was me, I'd ask people for things. They've not even asked me and they've used all my eyeliner up and then they laugh about it. And they're running in, trashing the place up. It's just like, they've got no respect. I just needed like five minutes myself, do you know what I mean? And in this house, you can't get five minutes. Two thirty eight PM. Jedward are still setting things straight. Darren, 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 I'll take them out. I'll take them out. What? Yeah, go take them out. Take them out. I'll take them out. It's too right. I'll take, I'll take them out because I put them in there. How much? Do you Good lad, well done. 
big brother has called Kerry to the diary room. Oh. Hey! Hello, Kerry. Hiya. How are you? All right. Kerry, today is your daughter's 10th birthday, and Big Brother thought you'd like to celebrate the occasion with a really big cake. Thank you. Big Brother would also like to give you the chance to talk to your daughter on her very special day. <laughs> Using just one breath, you must blow out as many candles as you possibly can. For each candle you blow out, you'll receive a minute to talk to your daughter. OK. Good luck, Kerry. Thank you. Blow really hard. Great work, Kerry. You blew out eight candles with your first breath, winning you eight minutes with your daughter. Thank you so much. How do you feel? Really good, really excited. Kerry, the next voice you hear will be your daughter's. Wish her a very happy birthday from Big Brother. OK, thank you. Hi, Mummy. Hello, baby girl. Happy, Hi. Bir happy birthday. Thank you. Oh, I miss you so, so much. I miss you too. Are you having a nice time? Yeah, don't cry. Oh, baby, I'm not, I just miss you so much. I'm missing you too, Mummy. Oh, I love you all the world, to the moon, to the stars and back again. Me too. Well, you know what we've done in here, Molly? One minute past midnight last night, we all came in the diary room, even Jedward, John and Edward. Yeah. And we all sang happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Molly. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Yeah. I miss you so much. Yeah, I got my ears first. <gasps> You've done all right, because you're ten now. That means you, you can get your ears pierced. Oh, you've not got a boyfriend while you've been in here. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> right, now, no more asking me questions. It's time for me to ask you some questions. Go on, Number then. one, how are you feeling about being in the house? <laughs> I'm, um, I'm enjoying it. Um, it's hard. And the only thing that I miss is you guys. I want to clean the whole house, clean it from top to bottom, make it born clean. Yeah. Clean everything. A clean house is a happy house. Yeah. A clean house means that your mind is clear. John. Yeah. Like the house is clean, your, your mind's clear. So I think we should put all this stuff away and have nothing on the countertops. Can't wait to come home and give you a big kiss and a cuddle. Give my love to Max and Heidi and Lily. I will. I love you. Love you. I love you all the world. Up to the stars. And the moon. And back, and back again. again. Bye, baby. Love you. I love you so much. Bye. 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 Bye, Bye darling. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. How do you feel now? God, I miss her so much. I miss her more, but thank you so much. I really, really appreciate that. Thank you. Kerry, you may now leave the diary room and don't forget to take the cake with you. Thank you. How are they? Oh, sorry, I'm allowed to speak to Molly. That's all right. Amazing. Oh, good girl. Oh. Well done. That's sweet. <laughs> At least you got it, they didn't have to. Hey, listen, you got something. Oh, God, I know, I'm so thankful. Thankful, thank you, big brother. Mm. There's some cake there. Beautiful. Yeah. So, can we have a bit or not? Yeah, help yourself, it's swell, Molly. Go to everybody. Yum. So much. Four or three p.m. Jedward have been cleaning up for almost three hours. <coughs> it's a proper cleaning. It's spotless. Wow, yeah, it's amazing. Paddy, Bobby, and Lucian are discussing who they think will win Big Brother. Huh? You could see win. If anyone I hope wins, I hope it's that girl wins us. 
Yeah, man. Oh, girl. Kerry. What do you call her? Kerry. 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 I'd love to see John and Edward, wouldn't it? Yeah, man. Uh. There's, there's for the taking. Ten nine-year-olds. Ten nine nineteen. You know what, they're totally unaffected by this place, though. If you were a child, you wouldn't be affected by this place. Not children, though. They're 19. How would you call them 19, for God's sake? Copy yourself, oh, come on, Pat. Huh? Don't take it to heart. Don't I'm get not taking it. I'm not getting emotional. I'm not taking it to <laughs> You're heart. You're taking it to heart. I'm not. I ain't telling you You've the truth. You've been a sausage, Pat. What? You've been a sausage. Who's been a sausage? You've been a sausage. Would you have them sausages around you outside? Would I what? Would you have them sausages? Have them. Have them around you. With have them outside. around me. I'd have no problem hanging out with them <laughs> outside, nah, this, man, outside this house. You're not coming around straight now. You know what I mean? You go drinking with them boys. I'd have a beer with them, yeah. Cup is so fine. <laughs> they don't drink. <laughs> they'd, be, they'd be cheap to hang out with them. Boys will buy you a beer, have a Coke. Uh, I wouldn't have them around me. There's no good being two faced doing that. I wouldn't have them little assholes. I'm not being two faced about it. I'm being totally upfront with you. Uh, see, I said, I said, I'm not into that shit talk. I'd, you what? I'm not into that shit talk. I Talking what shit talk? OK, are we coming off here? I mean, you're coming out to something here. No, if no, we no, 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 say no. we're coming out to something here. Daddy, I'm not coming on to you. I'm talking to you. But don't, I can't... Don't mumble but stuff don't after the... I'm not fucking Who's with mumble? You. What? Who's mumble? I don't mumble. No, I'm saying... If we're saying something to each other... Yeah. Like... You, you're saying... Two, oh, oh, none of that two-faced stuff and whatever. I'm not having a go at you. Yeah. I'm saying, say to me and I'll say to you. That's right, That's yeah. right. A bit daft. Lovely. I wouldn't I've got, have so, it. I mean, it. I've no, got so much time for it. I'm not fucking you around. I wouldn't, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't speak shit to you. I wouldn't fuck you around here, yeah. you know what I mean? No. Uh, you know, if, we, if we're going somewhere with this, let's get oh, it sorted out. You know what I mean? And I apologize. Don't daft. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Who did this? The boys. I am so impressed. They always pull through. Good job, baby Kate. This looks incredible. Thank you so much. Back away, Pamela. Oh, get here. Thank you. Awesome. It's the best I've seen it ever. 7.43 p.m. While Darren sits alone... Pamela is chilling out <laughs> poolside. <laughs> So, it's actually great. <laughs> We're sitting down now, the chip in the pool, just chilling in the pool. <laughs> Lucian is showing yeah, Kerry okay. how he gets all the girls. Are you all right? Yeah, yeah. I'll yeah, go back, I'm good. Good. Good night. Yeah, it's all right, thanks. Are you yeah. out with anyway? Sorry? Are you out with anyway? I'm out on my own tonight. Your own? Mm. <laughs> all my mates pulled and ditched me. You know what? I can't stand these places. Why don't you come for them? Oh, mate's had a rough time with his missus, so I'm just kind of come for support. So quiet. Where would Chill. you like to go? Shaggers Point. <laughs> <laughs> <Back in> view. <laughs> I don't say I don't call it Shaggers Point. I call it Wishes Hill. I say you can make a wish or pay it. Anything can come true. So, <laughs> Has that ever worked? What? Has that ever worked? I did it once and it worked like a treat. Did it? No, I was being serious though. I was being deadly serious. I really liked her. You did, but it wasn't very last week. 9.29 p.m. All of the housemates are gathered for tonight's eviction. <laughs> you never I think I just heard a scream, Darren! <laughs> We love you, Darren. Oh, their bra's coming off, throwing them at you. I don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are. Good luck, you two. Oh, people. Yeah, we go. <laughs> Big Brother House, this hey, is yeah, Brian. Yeah. <laughs> Darren. Yeah. Pamela. Yeah. Your time has come. <laughs> For the last two days, the great British public have been voting to save. I can now reveal... The housemate with the fewest votes and the second to leave the Big Brother house is... Pamela! 
Ella. Oh, Pamela was a totally different, spontaneous, crazy person. And we're gonna miss her in the Big Brother house. It's not gonna be the same, but her spirit lives on. I found it really difficult. I found Pamela difficult. Um, bizarre. Uh, I think I've used the word crunchy nut. Pamela's a lovely lady. And may God bless her, because she's a good Christian woman. I just kind of felt that she didn't adjust to being in here. She was like my little makeup friend, you know, we used to do our makeup together. We used to always have the rollers in. I'm really gonna miss Pamela, but I'm really glad that Darren stayed. Yeah! Yeah! She was just in the wrong place at the wrong time with her experience. I think it was a good thing, to be honest with you. Angels watching over you guys, I love you! Bye you guys! Okay, here I go. Ready and I love you guys. With Pamela gone, Big Brother has gathered housemates for a surprise announcement. This is Big Brother. Big Brother can now reveal that half of the remaining housemates are about to be put up for eviction. Oh. The other half will be granted immunity. Oh. What does that mean? You're not, you're not... Um, it is up to evicted housemate Pamela to choose which four housemates will be granted immunity and will therefore oh. not face the public vote this oh. week. Oh. 1,000% would be John and Edward. <laughs> It meant a lot to us. I'm real thankful that Pamela picked us. I'm gonna pick Patty. God bless you, Pamela, no matter where you are. God bless you. Your third housemate you're going to save. Pamela's age, I bet I'm gonna be like that. Like always talking about makeup and what, you know, always in glitzy, vajazzle things. Who is going to be your final housemate to save? The mommy, the mommy, Carrie! Yeah. Oh, thank you, Pamela! This is amazing, this is me, Kara. Thank you so much. Pamela, you have saved oh Amy, Jedward, Kerry, yeah. and Paddy from the public vote this week. I knew the four she was going to save is obvious. She's not going to protect me. I, I, you know, I didn't do the same with her. I, I, everyone who got saved, I see winning. So it's not. Um, I don't begrudge it in the slightest. We didn't really connect, although I did fancy at the beginning. Hey, we all have our off days, don't we? We all have our moments. You know what? <laughs> Two weeks in a row. Yeah, I'm really happy about the situation. I'm. I'm I couldn't. It's. It's. It, it, it's a fair call. Ten twenty-two p.m. It's been 51 you, minutes since Darren was no, saved so by the public <laughs> vote. Oh, why feel so drunk for? What? Drunk? Do you feel a bit tipsy? Uh, yeah. A little bit, do you? Yeah, but it's adrenaline, so the whole thing mixed it into what? Are you shocked, Dale? Yeah. Shouldn't be. I'm, I'm, I'm really you. happy. I swear yeah. my life, I knew you weren't going to go. I, I thought, yeah, Darren won't go. Don't you she's a bad person, Pamela? No, I don't think... I never said that. I think she's got issues, but she's not a bad person. Oh. One Jedward is getting ready for bed. Mm. <coughs> I like hiccups, they make me hiccup. Hiccups are the best. Wanna get a hiccup? Hiccup, hiccup, sounds like this. 
Sounds like this. Sounds like this. Come on, hiccup. Yeah, sounds like that. Pamela chose not to save Lucian from eviction, so he's going to face a public vote for the first time. I'm nothing to lose now. No, I just don't. I, 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 as long as I've not made a yeah. sausage at myself. Just be you. As long as I've not made it. Yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy. Be you. But that's how you leave, whether it be whenever the eviction are, whenever it's after that, just be you. Don't be influenced, be you. No, yeah, completely. So I've told him from day one that Darren. What, what, what that what that thing vote said. did just proved it. Second chance is doing this as well. That's what I I Didn't that? I said to him, don't be influenced by me, by no, you, anyone. by Pat, Tara, no, Bobby. Yourself, your heart. Yeah. Well, we had that Be chat. you. Yeah. Mwah. Mwah. And you know, have One kiss, one kiss. Hold on, one kiss, one kiss. There's going to be another twist before Friday, though. <laughs> no. Tell you. No. No. But it's a good one. I feel a good one coming on. Oh, a good kiss. A good twist. Oh. <laughs> uh. <Later. laughs> I know. I know when my dad watches the show. I know this. He's gonna think over. Ten forty-five p.m. One Jedward is in the bedroom. The other Jedward has gone solo. But we'll see you again in final or whatever. No, we'll see, no, no, no. We'll see each other again. Yeah, because we'll have to be back but anyway. But I'm telling you. Yeah, exactly. We'll see each other again. Yeah. We'll be definitely. Anyway, I'm being serious. I really, want to, to, I really want to come watch the show. Let's yeah. leave with pride. No, I really don't that say that. Really no, I really do. do. I really do. So don't say that. <laughs> I wasn't saying anything, I'm just saying, yeah. You're taking the mic like you always no, do. No, I don't know. I'm talking I'm not, like Bob, I'm, I'm talking like Bob when I say that. Serious. <laughs> no, no. Okay, I just always talk to John, okay? I don't like to talk to like other people. So like, I'm actually being serious. Cool. Yeah, he's the more serious one, remember? <laughs> no. Edward, you're more serious. Edward no, I'm not. Was, no, I'm not. This is bit. Edward's like, John's the more aggressive one. No, he's not. Yeah, totally. And you're the more like. It's not aggressive. It's just not aggressive, but like. Oh, it's yeah. Composed. Like, yeah. It's like, and you're like we're the one do like this. you 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 like yeah. handle everything. Yeah. Like you you make it smooth. Yeah. You're the smooth oh, operator. Oh, oh. First few days, I thought, right, okay. Didn't you know, couldn't distinguish the difference at all. And now it's com you're completely different people. Yeah. You are. No, I'm being serious. <laughs> you are completely different. And it's not. It's and not. That is it's true. Nice, yeah, it's totally. nice. It's nice. Every, everyone said to me, "How do you know the difference between?" It's nice to get to know. Like, you know, it's nice to get to know you for you. When do you know the difference? I know the difference. It was a couple of days, wasn't it? And it was like you can, you can really it's, see. Yeah, it's, it's, no, it's, it's nice to know. It's nice to know. It's nice to know you for you. And John from John is easy. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It really is. But you know what? Honestly, like without you guys. None of us oh, survived so in this house. Yeah. None of us. You saved everyone in this house. No. Yes, you have. Thanks, Tara Reid. Appreciate it. I promise you that. Twelve ten a.m. Darren is alone in the garden. Some of the housemates are in the bedroom talking about the last time they had sex. I don't know about you guys, right, but today was my breaking point. I was just like, oh, I'm dying. The, Monday, the night before, yeah. The Monday, yeah. Are we sure? July. July. Are we sure? Are we sure? Can anyone tell then that uh, before you came in. No, 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 no. Then that before you came in. No, 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 no. I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you, right? My friends, um, the where, where I stay, where I've been staying, yeah. Um, a girl moved in. I got on really well with, and we kind of got together a bit. Who was this? But like, 
It's nothing serious. It's just she's cool, man. She's, she's yeah. a cool girl. Yeah, a she's got a career. She's, 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 she's what? She's 27. She's got a career on track. You know what I mean? She's. <sighs> I kind of just got involved. So you're in a relationship, right? No, no, I'm not in a relationship. Nothing like that. Nothing like that. Do you like her? What? Do you like her? And <laughs> Enough. You might not have to do this. Nah, 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 nah. We, we, we've got a wicked thing together. We, we're more mates than it. We, we're good friends. We're very good friends. Do you know what I mean? But it's like... Oh, what Nah, I'm not... Yeah. She's a sweet girl. But she's got a career going. I'm, I'm not 27 years old. I'm not looking for what she's got. Do you know what, what she's looking for? And then, um... Yes, she's a really nice girl. And I'm here, I'm You single. love her. Like like you fancy talk. her. Mom, boss is in love. You mad? No, Are you in love? She'd have to be someone, someone amazing to get through Kerry first. Yeah, I say I've got George Arley's bones. Exactly. You know what I mean? Nothing compares to me, baby. <laughs> One oh one AM. Bobby is on his way to bed. Oh, God. What happened? Can you sleep under that Bobby, could you? Yeah, that's fine. You know what, even, even though we're up for like eviction and stuff... I don't care. I don't care either. I, I I'm think totally cool. Really, really I'm cool about it. Yeah. The fact that we went this far, even... Yeah. The truth is, who cares? Completely. At the end of the day, you're gonna go back to your lab, I'm gonna go back to my Zach. Yeah. Can you imagine that? You're going back to your Zach. The man. husband that I don't even know I have anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright, you'll remember him as soon as you're out of here, trust me. You, you, you just okay, conserve your energy, that's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, I'm done. I'm gonna move. Good. Yeah. It's you know, so loud. Completely. There's no reason for fighting anymore between anyone. This is what I mean, it's like literally I feel like everyone's kind of. Yeah. We're still clicks, but we're all still good with each other now. Yeah, you know what? And you go home back I to it. I can genuinely say, I put them top four. Huh. Kerry, she loved. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Paddy, Paddy. Paddy's gonna. Every, 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 every person, every human being. Look how much we fall in love with him. This is what this is what I mean. Everyone will fall in love with Paddy. I think the boys have got their fan base. People hate them, but people will love them as well. Do you know what I mean? And I think I think it's a three horse race. Me too. Jedward, Kerry, and Paddy. And I think Paddy will take it. This week, Bobby, Darren, Lucian and Tara fierce the public vote. It's a vote to save. Who steers, you decide. To save Bobby, call 0901616172. To save Darren, call 0901616173. To see if Lucian call 0901616167 To see if Tara call 0901616170 Calls cost 36p from a BT landline. Calls from other networks may vary and from mobiles will cost considerably more. For details and terms, go to the Channel 5 website. Voting closes in tomorrow's live eviction show. Stay tuned for Big Brother's Bit on the Side with Dean Bowers, Lembit Orpik and Pete Bennett.